Welcome back to my let's play of Persona 5 New Game Plus. Today is another day where we are limited to some extent. Our morning is always taken up by that, or at least the early part of the early section of the day is taken up with that interaction with Mishima, where we advance his confidant rank to level 2, and we learn a little bit more about how the Moon Confidant link is really important because it ties in to mementos, it ties into you getting right information now. from Mishima about targets to take on in mementos Next throughout time, the rest of the game. And these mementos targets, there are lots of different parts of it, but the mementos targets play a pretty wide-ranging role throughout the game. They are often used as roadblocks within certain confidant links. So you need to complete a memento side quest in order to finish a confidant link. Um, but they also, as you can see, work in order to give you more in order to give you more experience. And they also give reason or give story-related reasons for certain things such as the jobs. So all or both of the jobs the, that we started very early on, convenience store and the flower shop, both of those jobs have mementos missions associated with them. And as you might imagine, there is there are rewards for collecting to for finishing everything in regards to mementos. And indeed if you actually want to unlock every location okay. in the game, Sounds you do now. need to complete mementos missions because one of the locations is only available after reading a book, and that book is only available That's after completing a Mementos bridge. mission. So Mementos is pretty important, and as I mentioned in the last episode, we're going to be visiting okay. there multiple times 
throughout the playthrough. Hopefully, sort of about doing, once per palace, and we'll have an opportunity to uh, to, to really mm, make some progress, work. do some grinding, and um, that's what you're earn like it, hopefully okay? a large amount of money. Because what we're finding that? is that a lot of things are very expensive. Speaking of money, seeing as we got all of that money from our run right. in Mementos right. last one? episode, we're going to spend a lot of it here, sort of decking out our characters, what getting a bunch of the right. um, various weapons and so melee and get ranged weapons, buying some protectors, some accessories, that sort of thing. Okay. It's usual that at the start of a new palace or in between like palaces, it. you want to That's what you're don't break it, okay? come over to EY's shop and just make sure that you've got at least close to the best equipment that you can have at that time. Mm, and again, it's also worth uh, noting that you will break. find pieces of equipment from EY's shop located That's around the place. You can it, okay? find them in chests in mementos or in chests in the palaces. But it's always right. good to make sure you have right. um, the best armor and the best weapons ahead of going into a new palace. <coughs> For the rest of today, we are going to continue making progress with the Sun Confidant okay. line, and that is involves going and doing the beef bowl shop okay. job once more. Now that we once we've done it That's twice, fine. that should allow us. That should unlock. Um, the opportunity to finally begin the Sun Confidant line, which is really, really useful, as I've mentioned before, in another way of making sure that we have access to a fair amount of money. So we're going to work at the beef bowl shop. We're going to get the uh, come again. first of the beef bowl uh, additional things, which is needing to memorize some orders. If you get them all right, you get a bonus. And yeah, I think that's going to be it. So I hope you have enjoyed this episode, and I hope you will join me on the next. See you again. Hmm, good work. I'm counting on you. All right. Mm. 